how many more answers can you generate? How can you generate those answers? Fill up a page with these answers, then turn the page and look at other opportunities, and then turn that page. It's called diverging thought, that we don't have one answer, we've got a range of answers. So we're going to have an exercise here where we try, what winning is, is getting the widest range of answers that you can. This is a very simple challenge. Let me show you what's involved in this. <clears throat> Here you are. You're standing on a sidewalk outside of your school. There's your school. You want to get from here to there. How many ways can you think of to do it? We have you in clusters for a reason. We want you to talk among yourselves and listen to each other without judging, listen to the ideas and write them down or mind map them or sketch them. We need them all on paper. If you fill up one sheet, great. Grab another sheet of paper. And at the end of all of this, we'll ask you, what alternatives did you come up with? All right? So, does anyone have any questions? All right. Does everyone have paper? I'm sorry? This is absolutely a group project. Absolutely a group project. But everyone needs to participate. We got it? All right. You might want to choose someone who's going to be a scribe or someone who is specifically responsible for making sure that all the ideas get down on paper? Are we all set? Let's start now. <laughs> 